Welcome to my weekly roundup of what I've been up to in Hackney and Westminster. Parliament returned this week after a short recess and the dominant issue of discussion was the tragedy in the Middle East. Labour called for and Parliament passed an immediate humanitarian ceasefire, an immediate release of the Israeli hostages and a vital aid to be ramped up into Gaza. We also raised very real concerns about a possible ground offensive into Rafah, saying it would have catastrophic consequences and must not happen. But we were also clear that a ceasefire without a longer term political horizon will not be sustainable and called upon partners around the world to work towards that long term two state solution that we desperately need to see, but which hasn't been enough of a priority uh, in recent years. I still believe this is possible and it would be a top priority for an incoming Labour government to work towards this so that the people of Israel and Palestine could live in peace and harmony. The Public Accounts Committee published our report on online safety. The Online Safety Act was one of the first in the world to try and regulate the internet and it falls to Ofcom to do that. They've made a good start but we've made clear in our report it will be some time before the public see the difference. With over 100,000 service providers around the world to regulate, it is a huge challenge. So do look out for our report on that. Tragically, a 17-year-old was murdered in Hackney uh, last week. There has been an arrest in that case, but I've been liaising with the police and the council about wider community safety issues, and Labour wants to see an end to our young people being killed on the streets.